Hi everyone, welcome back. Thank you for being here. And here I am in the morning making a cup of instant coffee. Well, it tastes okay. <laughs> But you know, the most important thing is it's really quick to make. So in this video, I want to share with you how I teach myself to learn painting. There is some strategies that I've been doing. Obviously, there is still room for improvement. So it would be nice to get a feedback from you. And you can share with me as well what is your strategies and maybe we can help each other. Firstly first, I have to have a clear objectives and goals. At the beginning, I didn't even realize that I need that. I make sure to have a clear and realistic objectives. That way, I won't experience burnt out and disappointment. My first objective is to learn one online course at least once a week. Here I'm taking an oil painting class, Master Color with a limited palette. Now I'm making a color wheel based on Mansell color system. It specifies colors based on three properties of color, which are hue, chroma, and value. Now I'm making chroma by mixing two complementary colors. In this color wheel, there is three boxes for chroma. The deeper I go, the more neutral color it produced. I just realized here in this color wheel I have to mix red with blue green but instead of that I mix red with just green <laughs> well what to do <laughs> so annoying but it's okay it's well I guess it's part of the learning process <laughs> And oh, I finally get this plant! It's really cute. It reminds me of that Studio Ghibli, um, the one in Kiki's Delivery. My second objective is At least I practice minimum one painting once a week. Here I'm doing sketch first before I actually paint it. It's really good practice because now I can see what is the problem and I can solve it before I actually paint. So later on, during the painting stage, I won't make too much mistakes. This is my first time using charcoal and I made a mess. <laughs> Today I just want to paint casually something small on my sketchbook. I put one layer of gesso, um, but when I was painting, I had a problem. 
probably because the gesso layer is too thin. Next time I'll make it double at least. I want to introduce you to my kitty. Her name is Jean. Um, she's very chatty. Bye. Bye. I should say that the painting that I did, this one, is not really... I, I didn't really like it, but yeah, I'll make a better one next time. <laughs> My third objective is to paint a master study from my favorite painter at least once a month. This one is from John Singer Sargent. It's called A Lady Agnew. Really love it. My fourth objective is reading art book or artist biography for inspiration. I switched my iPad with my phone because I didn't have the book in the iPad. Only few of them are there. Um, some of the art books that I've downloaded are in the iMac and the iMac is broken and the Kindle is broken as well so <laughs> everything is broken so just use whatever you have really otherwise we won't do anything now I'm checking on money book beautiful really money and money seriously maybe they are twin in their previous life <laughs> I love both of them